Greetings, internets. Greetings, internets, not greetings. Thinker 2112 here at 2105 Eastern Daylight Time on Monday, the 18th of April, 2011. I have discovered that my capture card is very, very jealous. Does not, it does not like to be run along with other programs, and it's already skipping like crazy. I don't know what it's doing. This is a 16-bit game. Anyway, uh, welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. Alright, remember those weird dudes in the painting from before? Paintings from before? You have to remember the order. Um, is this guy next? No, it was not. Which means I have to fight. Luckily, these guys go down pretty easily. Oh my god, the skipping is throwing off my timing. Seriously, I don't know what it is, but my computer seems to be getting slower by the month, practically. Even by the week. The performance keeps getting worse and worse. Yeah, and of course it resets. You know what? I can't pause without going to the menu screen. All right, maybe it was the pirate next. All right, so when you put them all in order like that, you get the elder key. I'm gonna try something. Maybe this will help. Um. I have been running this computer just on AC power. I've had the battery removed because I was afraid that it was like expanding and might explode at some point. But you know what? I don't think it's expanding. I think the cover is just getting misshapen or something. Because uh, I noticed that the computer seems to have gotten slower since I started since I took the battery out. I have to close this thing. Come on. Alright, battery's in. Let's see if I get any better performance now. The computer does appear to be working a bit harder. Maybe that's good. Oh, yes, this is smoother. <laughs> okay, that's, I guess, why it's called the Elder Key. So, here we have a chunk. However, you do not have to fight this chunk. Okay, this is actually a very good weapon for Bowser, like, this is, I think, a couple of levels ahead of what you get normally. Oh uh, yeah, this menu screen. Maybe it's because the background is always moving. Oh, I guess it's only an attack boost of 10. But I know it's better than the next weapon that you can buy for Bowser. Yeah, I, I guess it's because the background is constantly moving. That's probably why my capture card doesn't like the menu screen. Anyway, what do we have next? Ah, we have broken physics. There's no way that that could really happen because the momentum would have to be... Like, the energy and the momentum. Y you can't transfer more... You can't transfer more energy than you had. The, ener the total amount of energy was growing, and that can't happen in real life. Oops. Okay. Yeah, the timing on that one, on the chomp, is you want to press A just as Bowser is releasing it. Well, that sucks. That wasn't a body slam, that was a hammer smack. 
should remember not to. Oh, never mind. I guess that worked. Yeah, so we'll swing it around like three, three and a half times, something like that. Yeah, I'm not sure why the battery, why putting the battery in would make the computer's performance any different when it was already running on power. Like AC power, maybe it just... Okay, that makes no sense. A full house is one card and a, and a wild card is five. That makes no sense. Anyway, I don't know, maybe it just can only get a certain amount of power from... AC power and it gets more from the battery. I'm not sure, I'm not a computer expert. No, no, no. Yeah, so I'm just going to try to avoid the menu screen. Like, obviously, I can't avoid it entirely, but. I'm going to try not to visit it too much. Was that a hidden block? I guess not. I'm not going to be like going into every... Oh, this room. There are random battles here. Normally in this game there are not random battles, but in this room there are, because you can't tell where the... Ow! Where the enemies are going to pop up. But since the room has a lot of frog coins, I'm going to explore it fully. These guys must have high evasion. Either that or I just got unlucky. Please don't hit Gino. Okay, thank you. Okay, I think it's time to enlist Mallow's aid here. Actually, I think I may want to switch party members here. I've been using this party for a while. Okay, bring in Mallow to... the other Gino. Oh, Mallow new learns a new skill next level. Yeah, I haven't used this party yet. Only possible party I haven't used. Yeah, I'm not gonna go for everything, but I am gonna go for all the frog coins in that key. That really hurts. That doesn't hurt so much. Ah, these guys do have high evasion. Okay, that opens, I believe, the door that was right at the upper left. They also have high speed, apparently, because they're always going first. Which is too bad, because if they didn't go first, they wouldn't get turns. Bowser is kind of hurting. Hmm. Let's see how powerful this thing can be. Yeah, I thought Bowser might have enough hit points now that it wouldn't heal them all. But instead of having nine hit points, he's now missing now. So, that's better. No, thank you. Ooh, eight hit points. And four magic. Not that he uses magic much, but... Still, I'll take what I can get.
I'm not sure if the random battles in this room are, like, limited. Like, I'm not sure if... Like, if, if you kept running around the room, I'm not sure if you would stop running into them. Or if they just keep coming. No, I don't want any. Does that go on? No, I don't think so. What was that? Zoom shoes. I'm guessing those increase speed. And Bowser's the only one without an accessory. I'll put them on him. And also increases, they also increase defense and magic defense. This seems like the kind of room where they put a hidden block, but looks like there isn't one. Okay, one more frog coin. Oh, I don't like that. No, oh, it didn't do as much damage, I guess because it has that accessory on. Zoom shoes. Oh, come on. Again, I, I wish we didn't have to watch these animations over and over again. They kind of get boring after a while. Of course, that vice is hardly limited to this game. It's a rather common sin of RPGs. It's one of the reasons why the battles in Xenosagas take so damn long. Okay, these chomps you can fight. <laughs> it's cannibalism. Ow. Why is this room always so hot? I wish they would turn off the heat. It's like... How hot is it? It's... Okay, 56 degrees isn't exactly balmy, but it's not, you know, blast the heat weather. The reason why I'm avoiding more battles is because someone commented in one of my videos that I was a bit overleveled. And he was probably right. Talk about delusional. Oh, I thank you. I'll take the experience points. You can run away from that. At least I'm pretty sure you can. Bom nom nom. Look, I'm on TV. Anything back here? Are those gonna blow up? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> so silly when he jumps up and down like that. And he cries rather abundantly when he cries. I think this may be close to the end. Oh, hello. I'm guessing that's a recovery mushroom in there. Yeah. Oh, come on. I'm pretty sure the end is in the next room. Oh, frog point. Oh, there's the mushroom. <laughs> Alright, I'll take it. 16 frog coins, not bad. 
All right. Notice that Mario doll? That will become important very soon. Hey, look, it's Samus, along with Peach and, I don't know, some other stuff. What is in there? There's something moving in there. Yeah, there should have been a hidden block. And look who it is! Of course the door's locked. Can't Bowser just bust it down? I don't know, maybe Peach doesn't know that Bowser's with him at this point. <clears throat> yeah. That seems like a good idea. Okay, now you have to play this mini game. If you lose, um, then you have to go to an extra boss fight that's kind of tough and doesn't have much of a reward. Hey, I'm moving while they're talking. If you win, then if you if you succeed at the mini game, then. Uh, Dude, you don't get married because you want to have a party. At least, that's not why you should get married. Actually, people's reasons for getting married have, like, changed a lot in the past 100 years or even 50 years. A lot of people don't realize that. Like, the whole idea of marrying for love, um, I think it's a good idea, but people don't realize that it's a pretty recent one, or at least that it's become so widespread is pretty recent. It used to be a lot of times just a matter of convenience or anyway um if you win this mini game then you skip that boss fight make her smile does she have mobile facial expressions the doll um then you get to skip the boss fight and i think you get <laughs> you get an extra item too so how does booster know this he just, he just demonstrated that he wasn't sure who Mario was. But, and he has a doll, this all makes no sense. I'm sure the game developers were completely aware of this, and just did it to make this seem funny. Alright, so all you have to do is be somewhere where the Sniffit is not. If you succeed four times, you move to the next round. Um, oh, never mind. Five times. <laughs> Alright, round two. They will start to get a bit tricksy eventually. Whoa! They'll always give you at least a second or two to react, though. Oh. Alright, I guess this round is longer. Seven. Alright, now here comes the toughest round. All three of them. Which means there's only one curtain for you to hide behind. I'm not sure if the pattern's the same every time, or if it changes from... Or if it's random. Um... In any case, you can get spotted twice. <laughs> okay, so he notices the doll, but he doesn't notice the real Mario, whom he just bombed. You can get caught twice with no penalty, but the third time you'll get in, you'll have to fight Booster. But I got through the uh, mini game, so I don't have to do that. I thank you. <sighs> so the password is whatever you named your file. Uh, herp, herp. <laughs> 
All right, I'm going to save because a boss fight is coming up anyway. This boss, boss fight. This boss fight happens um, whether or not you succeed in the mini game. Oh, and I have Mallow in my party, which means I can read these guys' minds. Can I jump on the Mario? Yes, I can jump on the Mario doll. <laughs>